let's offer my fruits in the end. I carry your presents everywhere. Oh my, your mind is so full of me. Mortal man, awesome God, mortal man. Am I by Noella? Um, of course, it was it was um Jean that requested you know I do a tutorial on how to play um this song. It's really a, an amazing song. You know, it's a song that just tell of how that you know we are we are just nothing but God still you know love us. Our essence is the fact that God loves us. So welcome to Alfred Serial and um if you have not subscribed, just hit the subscribe button before we even move further um, with this lesson. Yeah. So see, this is how to play um, Who Am I? That's Mortal Man, Awesome God by um, Nuela. I hope I got the pronunciation of the name right. But I think it's spelled N-O-E-L-L-A. Yeah. By, that should be Nuela yeah so okay how do we play this song the song was originally played in the key of b that was when you heard me the, the, trying to sing there it was on the key of b but i'll keep this very 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 simple um we'll learn it on the key of c yeah Yeah, so let's just move straight to um, the lesson. So how do you play Who Am I by, by Noella? Um, the, co the chorus of the song, um, Mortal Man, Awesome God, is quite easy. Um, but let's start with the, let's arrange the song. We have the intro of the song, then you have the verse, then you now have um, the... Um, the chorus of the song then you now have some to um, turnarounds you know like how do i reconcile until you learn for yeah something like those part of this um um the song um so the intro of the song let's let's go um what they did in the intro of the song is um they just sustain on a c sus 2 chord that's a B source two, but since we are learning on the key of C, that's a C source two chord. Um, a C source two chord is like this: you bar, and then you place your two hands. Um, this hand is here. I, I guess you, it's clear enough. You can see my fingers here, and then um, here. That's it. That's the sister's two chord, then you bar. But for a beginner, this is hard. Let's just assume you don't even know how to bar. So what do we do? Let's just use our normal C chord. This is the C major chord. And then you can decide to just remove this finger. This is a C-2 chord. Yes. Um, the reason why it's a C-2 chord um, is not, it's not for this video. So I'm not going to go into that detail. I, I just want this video to be straightforward and um, short and then simple. So that you can learn um, very, very, very fast. So now... um, um this is the C sus 2 chord. So they started on that. So that da 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 da. You then play 
fa so you see simple dun 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 you see the G chord that's F then G I'll be I'll be calling instead of calling the so far like the notes of the song like do re mi I will just stick with um just calling the um chords instead so you can you will know you know how to play um the song so that's the intro of the song then the verse of the song starts you hold me so close feel your breath over me Said you ne you never leave be with me every day. So that's the first. Um, I might not be singing the whole um, lyrics of of this song. It's just so that you get the chords. You go find out the lyrics, or maybe I'll um, leave the lyrics somewhere so that you can maybe on the, in the description so that you know the lyrics. Um, you get the lyrics of the song. Okay, so now um, let's learn the verse of the song. Um, you hold me so close. It's on a C chord. You start on a C chord. Then the next chord, this is the C chord. Then um, the next chord is the A minor chord, which is your, this is your A minor, A minor chord. Then you have your F chord. This is F, and then this is um, the G chord. You have this little finger here. Then you have um, the middle finger. Then you have the ring finger up here. So this is the G chord. So you play down, down. Now there are two ways to play it. Since you are is the first part of the song, the first um, verse of the song, you can just play it down, down strong. You hold me so close, you feel your breath over me. You see. It? Simple chords, four chords for the um, um, verse of the song. So let's say, let's just now say you um, you want to play the second verse of the song. Um, what you what you can what you can do is to play the like this drumming. Down, up, up, 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 down. Something, I think the second verse of the song is, I am your friend, you call me blessed and praise, something like that. Um, so, um, you can decide to do, I am your friend, I am, uh, uh, uh. okay, let me take that again. I am Yeah, so that's where you want to play the second part of the song. So let's continue with, with the, the the second verse of the song. Let's so let's continue now with um what we we're learning earlier. So now um um after you play, you hold me so close, feel your breath over me, which I've taught you already. And you said you never leave, be with me every day. Then you will not suffer my foot to be moved. From that part, like down to the second verse of the song, it's just three chords. What are these three chords? It's um you have F, your F chord, you have the, the G chord, and then you have A minor chord. Simple. All you just need to do is to play these chords. So now let's let's um let's let's play the chords. Let's you know let's let's play these chords now. So, you will not suffer my foot to be moved. I carry your presence everywhere. Poor mind, your mind is so full of me. Is it? 
just a down down starts um gradually before you remember what we said for a beginner you you need to get used to chords get used to chords is very very important because you will need it throughout your entire guitar um career or throughout your lifetime as a guitarist you need chords whether you are playing um finger style or a jazz kind of play you will need chords so get used to chords i'm serious get used to chords <laughs> okay so um um remember you will not suffer my foot be more i carry your presence everywhere you see that's the chords the f then G major, then A minor chord. So you sing all that, then mortar man, awesome God. Up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down. You see the way I'm changing my fingers? So just try as much as possible to follow or to know. Let's play it together. Down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down. So you are ending that down on the A minor chord. Down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down. So if you are not used to change changes, chord changes, this is a tutorial for you. Down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down. You see that? Yeah. So um, that's um the 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 first verse and then the chorus for the second verse is the same thing i am your friend you call me blessed with um you took me from the mary clay sent me on the rock to stand you will not suffer the same thing then into the or the like the, is it the third standard or like the turn around that i talked about earlier how do i reconcile unto you how do I reconcile unto you? How do I reconcile unto you? It's there for me and grace. Something like that. Just please, I, um, I just here yeah, for th for this class to just show you the chords of this song. I didn't really have so much time to really look through the lyrics of of this song, but it's it's, it's, a, it's a it's an amazing um, lyrics by the way. But get the chords, get the chords, okay? How do I reconcile unto you? You have A minor. Or maybe let's talk about the chords um, first of all. You have um, an A minor chord. Then you have the G chord. Now, sometimes in the song, instead of playing a G chord, you can decide to play a B, a G over B. Um, okay, this, this, um, lesson is not for explaining, um, slash chords, so to say. Um, so let me, let me say this. I might decide to cut this video or these tutorials into two or three parts so that you can learn some other things just aside the, um, the song itself. So that the video is not just um, you know ex excessively lengthy, yeah. Okay, that's just let letting uh, letting that you know out there. So let's make progress now. I was talking about slash chords, and I said um, slash chords um, simply means the 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 base is the when you when you when, let's say you go online you see G slash B. What that simply means is that. Um, the base will be B. G slash B simply means the base will be B. So what do you do? What you do is simply, this is the G chord. And uh, this is some theory. And this is the B note. This um, second fret of the fifth string. That's the B note. So you are removing this G for making it, you are not 
playing like you're not making it sound like when you're playing the chord you're just focusing on that b so that's the g slash b chord so now you know the g slash b chord and you can decide to use it instead of using the g chord and you can also decide to use the g chord instead of the g slash b chord so um you get that okay i think it's it's almost 15 minutes into the video so i'm making this a two parts um tutorial yeah so part two next